Some products are more dangerous than others. If a product injures a consumer, does the fault lie with the designer or the consumer? A truck driver falls from his truck and speeds to court to learn the answer in Timpty Industries v. Gish. Robert Gish drove a truck and trailer manufactured by Timpty Incorporated. The trailer's top was open for loading, and its front had a ladder and narrow platform. The rungs of the front ladder went to the top of the trailer to stabilize the ladder. A sign near the middle of the ladder provided several warnings and instructed users to keep at least three limbs in contact with the trailer. The slippery, extruded aluminum walls of the trailer were less than six inches thick. The rails at the top of the walls were slanted inward, so small spills slid into the trailer. Frequently, Gish picked up loads of fertilizer at a plant. On arrival, Gish weighed his truck to ensure it didn't exceed road weight limits. The plant's downspout filled the trucks with fertilizer. A rope attached to the downspout allowed truckers to lower the downspout. One day, Gish couldn't adjust the downspout, so he used the ladder on the front of his trailer to climb on top of the rail. Wind knocked Gish from the trailer, severely injuring his legs. Gish sued Tempty Incorporated and its parent company, Tempty Industries, collectively Tempty. Gish alleged that Tempty defectively designed the trailer and failed to sufficiently warn him of the dangers of climbing on the rails of the truck. The trial court granted summary judgment for Tempty. The appeals court reversed. The Texas Supreme Court addressed the issue.